Hello everyone. I think I'm live and welcome to Pennsylvania Ballet Academy's live Instagram. I am David Garapetian and I am very excited today to be here with you because my conversation today is going to be with Miss Yuan Yuan Ten, a principal ballerina with San Francisco Ballet. And we are going to chat and talk about her career and everything that you would be interested to hear, which I'm super excited. I've been partnering her for many years when I was with uh, San Francisco Ballet and uh, super fun. So I'm super excited. Um, um, <clears throat> and you are welcome actually to write any comments or any questions that you have and I will ask uh, Miss Tan uh, and see what we can do. And now let me just get into finding Yuan Yuan. Oh Hi. my god. Hi How Yuan are you? Yuan. How I'm are you good, Davi? My dear, how are you? So <laughs> good to see you. So good to see you. <laughs> How's it going? Where are you right now? Uh, at home. At home? Yeah, yeah. at home. And then um, just, uh, you know, uh, I tried to do class with Lisa, uh -huh. but I got, like, I slept it. <laughs> oh, my God. I miss her classes. Listen. Oh, it's, you still it's, can do his, her I know. Class. I yeah. know. I know. I know. Sunday. I did. I did a couple times. Yeah. But then things came and then everything I was see, just. I see. I see. Yeah. But yeah, I miss everything. I miss you. It's so nice to see you and you nice look great see. as usual, my dear. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, so we're yeah. super excited to have you. Thank you for joining us. And no, thank you, you know, for thank you for inviting me. Of course, uh, of course. It is my pleasure. You know that. So today we just wanted to know about you in general, about your career and you know, anything that you can share with our audience and students and anybody who's, you know, you know, in love with you, with ballet mm -hmm. and with in general, you know, that we would just love to have whatever you have for us. Um, I guess first you can maybe just talk about your training, you know, where you were trained and born and oh. all this so that, you know. Okay. Well, I start a training ballet professionally. Uh, just like in Russia, you know, the school, Vaganova school, usually you enter the uh, uh, school around like 10 years old. Mm -hmm. And then uh, you, you, you did, you, you have to make an audition. Like, yeah. yeah. So I was a couple thousand of the kids, right? Made mm. audition. Oh my God. So my <laughs> class is 12 boys and 12 girls. Right. So that was uh, what happened. So I, I entered, but my father doesn't want me to do become a dancer mm -hmm. um, because he thinks the ballet is Western art. And then uh, I'm a Chinese. So he thinks that I should be, you know, engineer like him or mm -hmm. doctor or lawyer. Some, mm -hmm. some job are stable. And, mm -hmm. But uh, he thinks that uh, why, why, a Chinese dance ballet and mm -hmm. you will never never make it that's what he thinks so then um, I uh, my actually my mom really support me and that's mm -hmm. her dream to become a ballet dancer that's her mm -hmm. dream so that oh. the, the dream wasn't fulfilled because my grandfather doesn't want her to dance oh my so, god yeah so and she thinks that I have the talent she thinks then she insists that if I'm already made through the audition, why not try? At least right. try. Right. So my father against it, and they fought for it, fought to each other day by day. And then finally, my mom is like, well, we have to make a decision because it's already a year passed by. The school is like clocks ticking. If she's not going to enter, that she will miss the entire year. So um, they flip a corn to decide if I go a, or a not. A coin. Oh my a God. Coin. <laughs> That's uh, then, of course, my mom winged. And then, uh, then I went to school a year later than the others. Mm -hmm. So my uh, I start at age of 11, mm -hmm. enter the school. And then uh, 
my class is interesting. We usually have seven years, seven years for training. Right. And then in to my class- To graduate the school? After seven graduate. years? You, okay. And then you go to the company right away. Okay. Uh, no audition needed. Usually you just like, just go, right. go straight from the school to the yeah. company. Then um, at that time, there's an honorary uh, principal in the school. She, mm -hmm. she thinks that our class is, you know, the physique is not good enough. And then we are not like a perfect body. And then she's, she's like, well, this class, 24 of them will be wasting teacher's time. So oh she decided, she decided to have us to only have six years. Interesting, okay. Yeah. Uh, and then she <clears> had <throat> the power to do so at that time. So we, we, we learned six years and graduate. For me, five years graduate. Mm -hmm. yeah. I was a speedo, like very wow. speedo. Wow. So yeah. A talent yeah. right there. <laughs> so I finished it five, in five years and then graduate. And then I got a uh, scholarship to go to Germany because mm -hmm. I got uh, international uh, oh, Paris competition, international ballet mm -hmm. competition, uh, gold medal winner. And then uh, also as age of 16, I won the uh, Nijinsky award in Japan mm, competition. Nice. That's, and that's also, exactly what I was going to ask, like how old were you then when you 16. started to 16 competition, competitions and all that? Yeah, uh, at the age of 15, I was represent uh, China, uh, do, did this uh, competition in Finland, Helsinki. I got silver medal when I was 15 and mm -hmm. then 16, I went to Paris and then I went to Japan. Mm -hmm. Like in Paris is in November, in Japan is January. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So back yeah. to back, I had like two competitions in one. So mm -hmm. yeah, that was well, hard. Yeah, I'm sure. But I mean, look where, you know, the future just ended up for you and how you're just become like an incredible star. You know, Thank it's... You. Uh, of course, I mean, you know, I, I think everything it's it's happens for a reason and it's meant to be, you know, where you are, how much of training, like you, you did like two, two years of less training, but it put yeah. you in a place that, you know, your future just started, you know, a yeah. career started. And uh, so how long were you in Germany or in Europe uh, in general? Uh, Germany, I got a scholarship and I, ha I got two years scholarship. Then mm -hmm. I, uh, uh, I did half year. And I went back to Shanghai to visit my family. It's a uh, winter break. So mm -hmm. they have pretty long winter break. And then uh, I got a letter from Helgi. Mm. That nice. time. And then uh, he just invited me to do some uh, Nutcracker and Gala. Mm -hmm. So Nutcracker in December and then Gala in January. Mm -hmm. So I said, oh, sure, I can go. And then after the uh, Nutcracker, after the Gala, and I was like, okay, well, I'm, I'm going to yes. go back to Germany, continue to study. Mm -hmm. and, but he asked me if I w would like to join the company mm -hmm. uh, as a soloist. He's like, you're not going anywhere, right? <laughs> as a soloist. Wow, sounds that's like fantastic. School, another a, a year and a half, or a soloist with SFB? Soloist of with SFB, of course. Well, you know, whoever doesn't know to our audience, you know, Yuan Yuan is celebrating her 25 years with San Francisco Ballet, which is incredible. I'm so happy for you. And I'm actually also very happy being part of that, your career, because we've been partners and dancing so many different things and traveling and all that, which has been incredible. Yeah. So, Love to dance with you and miss to be uh, your partner because, you know, I don't think we're partnering enough. We should partner more, but you always assign with, what's her name? Maria Kuchikova, right? <laughs> true. I had a lot of partners. See? I know, I know, I yeah. know. It's true. Because you're it's always true. busy with her and then I don't get to dance with yeah. you often oh, I, enough. I love yeah. dancing with you. And, you know, I can, I remember actually when I joined the company in 2005, you were actually dancing. Your partners were Yuri Pasakov. Yes. And it was his last year. And mm -hmm. Damien Smith. Damien uh, Smith. Which, yeah, it was incredible just to see you guys. And then uh, Yuri retired after a year I was at the company. And then mm -hmm. you were dancing a lot with Damien. And 
um, you know, and then Damien retired and then you just, yeah. and then we start dancing a lot yeah. together, which, which is, was incredible. Um, so tell me a little bit about um, what do you do like other projects and stuff like within being in a quarantine? I mean, it is very hard for any dancer, any company, professional uh, student, you know, just being mm -hmm. home. And I know that you used to travel a lot to China and do a lot yeah. of projects. How are you managing all this? So uh, I was basically was asked to go to uh, Dance Open, like which I invite you like a right. cu couple years ago. Correct. Yes. Now, I think I love that, that theater, Alexander. Oh, yes, uh, Alexander Yes, yes, it's beautiful. And then, I always can see so many beautiful dancers there mm -hmm. and it's a great program and then, right. but I cannot go um, because pandemic mm -hmm. and I was scheduled to go to China doing the project with the school and that's not happening. But I think right now I'm just busy with a lot of like project with China and in, in internationally with online. Like if I needed to do lecture or uh, tell the story or doing something it has to go go like not zoom but some somehow like face to face and talking and give some classes so mm -hmm. it, it is hard but i think uh, we all doing that mm -hmm. like like one time i took a class with vanessa <laughs> i was like i have to turn off the camera it was so difficult <laughs> oh yeah, she she teaches hard classes. I oh think. Oh my god! Yeah, it's so hard. It's so hard. And I uh, I also uh, took your class as well mm -hmm. on that line. I think it's uh, you know great to get uh, a feelings of different teachers. Yeah, because yeah, I was true. never, I was never had this experience, but mm -hmm. I actually uh, liked it. But with the limitation at home, it's always harder. Of you course. can't, you can't move. No traveling, you have to, no movement, no jumping, and no, you yeah. can do certain things. And, yeah. yeah, and uh, actually, I have to tell you, the muscle feels different. Mm. Of it's, course, it's kind of a weak. Yeah, but in yeah. the way they're tight, but they're weak. Yeah, you they're feel not... like you're in shape, but you're not quite there because exactly. it's it's not the same. But you know, it's I'm actually very thankful, and I I'm gonna say, you know, like Ruben and Diego, they created this. Uh, platform, you know, worldwide ballet classes, which is mm -hmm. incredible for everyone. And, and, you know, I taught there and you did too, by the way, you're teaching 500 students, you know, people doing class. That was incredible. Great job. So it's, it's wonderful that, you know, you, they bring, you know, a lot of teachers and, uh, you know, I've, I've, I was taking so many different classes, which was great. And uh, yeah. I think it's a great platform within this, you know, situation that we're having, that everybody's trying to do their best and wherever they are, whatever they're doing, trying yeah. to stay in shape. You yeah. know, it's important for us, for the arts, so that, you know, we can stay positive. And so once we come out of this, you know, we're back into the studios and stage where, where we belong to, you know, so it's, yeah. it's, it's great. But, you know, I want to go a little bit back because you were talking about your parents or what you, your father wasn't, you know, uh, at first supportive because I know your parents and they're so supportive mm -hmm. of your, you know, career. And um, the other day, you know, I was watching uh, the SFB's gala, which was streamed. Yeah. And oh, my God, I was like yeah. so emotional because it was so great um, to to see you guys on stage and then and then when I saw that tribute to your 25 years with mm -hmm. the company with your mom oh my god that was mind-blowing I loved yeah. your mom being there and she was so into it. ah it was just incredible Vanessa said she cried by the way oh yeah yeah oh, yeah it was you guys were you you guys were oh fin. hold on a second see uh that's Diego <laughs> Diego, oh, Diego, can you see? I was. Uh, can you see? Can you see? What is he doing? No, he. Uh, Lisa just had a class. Hold on. Oh, a second. oh, 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 oh. Hi. <laughs> well, I don't know if. Uh, hi, Lisa. It's why why I'm talking to David. Hey, Lisa. How are you? <laughs> 
No, you know, she she asked when you're gonna to work out. I know, asked, I know, I know. When you're gonna work out? I know. So, next but, Sunday. Next Sunday, she's. He said next Sunday he will work out. Okay, let's do it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, I was supposed to take her class, but I, my mom did. Oh really? Oh, that's yeah, great. Yeah. Oh, by the way, listen, you. It was so incredible. That piece was so powerful. Uh -huh. Like just. Also, just your mom sitting over there was the whole time. She was so demanding. Oh my God, I loved it. I just, loved just it. like a tiger mom, isn't it? Oh, like, and then I, you guys were going all yeah. to bed. Oh my God, it was incredible. I love yeah. it. I love it. Thank you. So Thank great. You. So great. Congratulations. This is so awesome, Yuan Yuan. Thank you know, you. I I wish you know it would be a little bit different so you could celebrate on stage. And I, I was you know because when I heard you were gonna do twenty five, you know five years of you know celebration i said i have to go to that performance there's no way i was gonna miss and then unfortunately this all came and uh, it didn't work out but you know what you were not stopping to dance and you look gorgeous and you know you maybe maybe we'll celebrate the the 30 who knows <laughs> well who knows who knows but uh, you know i i think uh original plan probably like uh, yuri and carl gonna invite you mm. over that was they're like, oh, always they, they planned it already. Oh, yeah, like yeah. with Edward, Edward. Yeah, yeah, so, yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh. Uh, but I mean, I, I think as things happen for a reason. Now, most important is, you know, keep positive and keep Correct. the a energy going because it's not going to be anytime soon, I think, go back to the stage. Because mm -hmm. we have to go to the studio first and then get back to shape. Mm -hmm. And then if we allow to start rehearsing, mm -hmm. you know, especially for the part to do, I, I we feel safe to touch each other, right? To dance so right. closely, you know, it's a, uh, it's it's hard. And then it when is, we is. will have a stage, and mm -hmm. they will have audience or no audience to start performing. Without audience, it's different, different oh, feeling. No, that's just. Yeah. So it's so hard. I mean, you know, when you go on stage, they put that spotlight on you uh -huh. and you can feel that audience, you know, just even just when they're quiet, you can feel that energy. You can feel even their breathing just and it gives you so much energy, so much motivation because you're dancing for someone. You have so much emotion to give and to share with, you know, your artistry with them. It's yeah, it's it's going to be hard. And I hope, you know, everything gets back to normal so that, you know, everybody can share their love and passion with the audiences and yeah um now i know that you were just saying you know you do lisa's class and stuff i you know everybody wants to know uh how else do you stay in shape uh besides doing ballet you know like because it's important you know for you and you know me i don't work out i don't I do, do crossing so for me, purely it's the dancing, ballet, and rehearsing, mm -hmm. and I don't have time or energy to do anything else. Mm -hmm. But now I don't have so rehearsals. Then I do cross training, like uh, for Lisa's class, mm -hmm. and then I do I I I think I did some stretching classes, but I wasn't interesting, so I just stick with Lisa's class maybe once or twice a week. Mm -hmm. And uh, last couple of weeks, I was just busy with rehearsing with Yuri, like for the uh, for this new piece, because we try to do on Zoom, try to rehearse that. Uh -uh. It's hard because mm. we cannot feel, feel each other. Right. When when he says something, I just don't understand. <laughs> so with this little scream, you cannot really see what he wanted to do so mm -hmm. we basically just like follow the protocols and he wear mask and i went in the studio um like galena studio mm -hmm. to just the like new studios uh no or not, not, yet? not yet not not yet oh. the new studio will be ready next next year next yeah. year yeah so they are per, uh, they are like a partially uh did this like a uh, a little a studio in in one of the church in San Francisco. Oh, okay. So they did some kind of uh, it's like it's not permanent, just like right. for for just, just temporary, little yeah, temporary yeah. temporary mm -hmm. one. So I went in there just uh you know did a rehearsal with him. Uh, we finished for like t 
three days for this piece, like quick, very quickly. But we have to wait for two weeks until the filming. Mm. Because you know the union, they have oh. to go permit union, and then also uh, they want to use San Francisco Ballet Orchestra. Oh. Not the recording music, so they have to do the recording at their own individual home and have Martin to put everything together. So, oh my God, I, wow. I have to wait for two weeks, but I cannot stop. So I have to like make sure that you know the yeah. details with the with the this ba ballet is still in my body. So, mm -hmm. but I think for me there's something to do, and mm -hmm. I feel better. Otherwise, mm -hmm. I'm like. <laughs> who who was the composer for the music? Oh, he uh, it's on YouTube called uh, Victor some uh, Red Chain something like that. Uh -huh. I, and who, I'll send you the link. Okay, yes, please do. And who did the costume? Because it was beautiful. Oh, that costume was a couple years ago. Remember, Yuri did Carmen Padadou. Yes, v yes. Victor and Victor Lorena. And Lorena, yeah, yeah, yeah. That the costume that was the Lorena's. Oh my God! Wow, I didn't even recognize. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. She have a uh, a uh, black lace underneath. Mm -hmm. Um, but Yuri says, "Oh, um, it's too much ruffles, so they cut it." They the, oh. They took out one layer underneath of the black one. I and see. And so just leave the top one. Gorgeous, beautiful. Yeah. I mean, you know, because also the lighting, everything was uh -huh. different. It it looked different a little bit. You know, yeah. The, yeah, it looked different. No, but... and, yeah, but the yeah. whole thing. And where was it filmed? Uh, San Francisco Ballet Warehouse. Oh, beautiful! Like everything about that video was just gorgeous. I was like, oh my god, incredible! Yeah, and you look great, and your mom, and I love your mom. It's just so <gasps> adorable. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, wow. and then I have to tell you that was the first time I was in the warehouse. It's so much history in this warehouse, mm -hmm. and I saw the billboard, uh, all the all the poster like old times, have Roman on it, Yuri, Elizabeth Lascavio, Ashley Weider, oh and even God. even Betty Erickson oh and God. Anita. So many history in it, and wow. then there's a lot of all the setting was there. Sets all of the, the costumes costume, were there. Yes. Everything was there. And you know, props. I've I've been there once. I think I've been there once. You are? Yeah, uh, we went with George to uh, get a few costumes. I think uh, or something. Yeah, it's huge, yeah. but it's incredible. It's and I know it's it's incredible. You know what what these companies go through, you know, like how many, mm -hmm. the, the archive is just like, they have so many things and it's incredible, yeah. you know, once you go back to see these things and, you yeah, know, yeah, yeah. so many generations of generations, mm -hmm. it's wonderful. It's incredible, it's incredible. Yeah. And then, uh, I mean, uh, as Yuri's idea is, he doesn't want it to film outdoor. He thinks natural itself is so beautiful already. It, the dance will take away if uh, you are you have the background with Golden Gate Bridge or something something, right. and he hates it. So mm -hmm. he says, "No, no, there's no way I wanted to do outdoor." Yeah. Like he's yeah, he says I wanted to do like in the warehouse. Mm -hmm. yeah. So that all the tension goes into the dance and you and the mom, of, the relationship. Know, too many too many mm -hmm. distractions from outside. It's smart. I mean, I love Yuri. He's a genius. I think you know. He, his mind is yeah. somewhere else when he's creating yeah. or thinking, which is incredible. Yeah, um, he's incredible. He's incredible. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Fantastic. That's great, Yuan Yuan. You know, I was I was just so happy and to see you and you know, I saw bells you did with Vitor and because uh, we didn't dance, we didn't end up dancing, no? Or did we dance? I can't remember. We because did. I got I got hurt when when uh, we were supposed to go to China. But now mm -hmm. I can't remember if we did dance. We d we danced the bells at <gasps> St. Petersburg. Hang on, of course. Oh, that was, by the way, that was, but that, that was, was my, yes, by the way, that was my last time I danced. You know, I retired and my last performance was Swan Lake with Vanessa uh, uh -huh. in San Francisco. But my last time dancing on stage was with you, by the way. And that was, you know, bells and uh and then this, finding the finding light. the light, yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Oh, yeah. Of course, I'm like, hang on, I knew something <laughs> was like there, but 
and, and of course I shared the photo and I'm like, duh. Yeah. Uh, that's so great. yeah, you dance this piece and then yes, uh, yes, yes, so yes. you originally you did with Masha for the right. gala. Yeah. Correct. Yeah. 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 Wow. So, so so much so much greatness and you know and I have a we have student actually she's uh, training with us and she went to Pennsylvania Ballet to train for a summer program. Mm -hmm. um, you know I think they're doing virtually too. And then she uh -huh. emailed me. She's like, uh, you know, David, I was you know uh, doing a dance history and we we do training and all that. And then they show a video and it was the Scotch Symphony of uh, the Balanchine and you you were dancing and you were. My oh, partner, I was with, so. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah like, wow. Oh my God, what are the chances? So that was great, you know, to hear, you know, that they're sharing some videos and of us and, you know, it's, it's incredible. I miss dancing with you, by the way, my dear. Me too, me too, yeah. yeah. And uh, I think Helgi miss you a lot. Oh. And you think, no, one, day, one time you came over, you, uh, you taught class for the company. Mm-hmm. You know, uh, and then on stage. So he was walking by. He just like standing there watching you teaching. And I was like, oh, hi. It was so nice to have uh, Davi. He's mm -hmm. like, well, I wish he can come back. And we oh. need him here to dance. <laughs> I'm like, yeah. He's like, he's still in shape. I said, yeah. 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 No, I try to stay in shape as much as I can because I need to demonstrate with everything but you know it's just for myself also it's important you know because mm -hmm. i still in my mind i still think you know that i am still a dancer and yeah. i can dance still you know and i can do everything that i used to do even though that could be a little scary but <laughs> I, just... I think you're still in shape and so does vanessa like mm. she did everything with the hard class i cannot keep up <laughs> i know i know she yeah. does everything and it's she has a very hard class hard class yeah. Yeah. but why why thank you so much this was great for coming on to talk to me i miss you very much my friend um uh, we wish you all the best and um i hope that i'm gonna see you soon hopefully this quarantine yes. is gonna be gone so that you can do your uh traveling and yeah put your heart on stage again and you know i can't wait to see you to support you and uh, celebrate whatever it is um you know so much love to you and take care stay healthy thank you thank yeah. you davi yeah, yeah. So, so nice you, talking to you you too and I, you too my dear and i'm going to if there's everything uh, calm down like uh, you know everything's opened up i will uh, visit you guys yes yeah. you should you should yeah. absolutely yeah yeah we'll show you around it's yeah. it's small in here but you know yeah. it's really uh, amazing you know and you you can come and uh, see the school talk to our kids maybe teach class that would be yeah. incredible it would be we would be honored to have you and teach class and, and you can love, rest a little bit i would love to hold your baby <laughs> oh my god yes yeah, she's yeah. adorable she's sleeping actually we went to the pool this morning so she uh -huh. came and she was crushed now she's sleeping Tired. so uh -huh. that's why i can Good. sit for a little bit and have peacefully conversation uh -huh. with you <laughs> good timing good timing good yes. timing yes kisses to you. you take care Thank give you. my love to your family to your mom and dad and uh, well do yes we'll talk soon okay okay talk soon bye, bye, -bye. thank you ciao, bye. Ciao, ciao. bye bye okay well thank you so much everyone for joining us this was incredible um yuan yuan has been long time partner and friend and you know um uh, uh, we had a little bit of a history together so just being on stage and sharing the stage and uh, studios and uh, laughters and cries and all that uh, so it's been incredible thank you for joining us please if you have any questions any comments we would love to uh, share with everyone and answer your questions so um, until next time and we'll let you know who our guest is going to be next time all right have a nice day be safe and we'll talk to you soon bye bye